Happening today, the Urban Meets the Rule. The Douglas County Fair kicks off this morning right in the heart of Omaha at Crossroads Mall. Yeah, new location, but just because it's in a new setting, don't expect it to be a totally new fair. Jenna Jane joins us now live from Crossroads with a look at how the new is meeting the traditional. Jenna, good morning. Good morning, Dave and Cerise. Douglas County is changing and the organizers here at the fair see that and they want to appeal to a more broad audience now. Now, yesterday we caught up with vendors already setting up inside the mall, keeping with traditional 4-H excitement. These ladies are hoping they might have some prize winning quilts, crafts and foods. But inside there will also be magicians, science shows and even a few furry friends. We will have a show Saturday morning for both poultry and rabbits, but we will also have a petting zoo on the outside. Now, those larger animals that you might think to see at a fair, unfortunately, will not be here. Douglas County actually partners with Sarpy County's 4-H group in order to be able to put on all of those animals down at the Sarpy County Fair. That's going to be happening later this year in August. But if the fair has enticed you this morning, as it definitely should, you can come out starting this morning before the heat really sets in. Stop by today through Saturday from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. Now, that's going to be at the Crossroads parking lot at 72nd and Dodge. And best part, it's free to visit and to park. And again, most of those things will be inside so you can stay out of the heat, but outdoors you're going to see live music. They already have tents set up in order for food vendors to get in here. There's going to be bouncy houses, all sorts of entertainment for the kiddos. And then Dave Series, every single day, there's going to be a little bit of a different feature. So tonight there's going to be a family movie night. Tomorrow there will be a tractor pull. And on Saturday, dunk a Douglas County official. Ooh. <laughs> uh, that sounds like fun. Yeah. The Douglas County official is probably on the better end of that with this heat. Yeah, for sure. Get in the it's a little water. good to them, actually. So, Jenna, is the fair permanently going to stay there at Crossroads? It's probably not going to be a permanent thing. There's so much still up in the air with Crossroads and its future. So they are looking for a permanent location right now for the Douglas County Fair. They just haven't announced exactly what the plan is in the coming years. All right, Jenna James reporting for us live this morning. Jenna, thank you.